There's too many! Come on, babe! Kelly! She's dead, man! She's gone, Kenny. Let her go! I'm not leaving, babe! Get the fuck away from us! It isn't gonna go like this! Kenny! I won't be left alone again! We're gonna leave. We're gonna get out of this! Kenny! I don't care what these fuckers are saying! You're gonna be fine! She's gonna turn, man! No! What the fuck did you do? What the hell is going on? What the fuck? Why? Why? She was going to turn. I couldn't let that happen. Stupid fucking kid! Super Kenny! Damn it, man! This is on your head, Clementine! Fall behind, I can't come back for you. Let's 
Let's go. Is everything all right? No, I'm not all right. But I'll be a lot better once we get with the others. I need to make sure everyone else made it out. Luke, Sarah, Kenny. God damn it. What if they aren't there? If they aren't, nothing we can do about it. Don't even say things like that. Fine. Sorry. Jesus. I don't even know if we're safe. What if the herd is still following us? We're fine. It's been quiet, but who knows? We'll watch out for each other. So long as we keep up a good pace. I know, I know. Just, I'm going as fast as I can. I know I should feel glad that we escaped, but I just can't stop thinking about the others. How could I leave Alvin behind? It was stupid. What was? Escaping? Look, I know we all agreed to use the herd to get out, but maybe we should have been more patient. Come up with something better. It worked. If the plan worked, we got out of there. Most of us. Look, I know that some of your people didn't make it, but Carver was crazy. Staying would have only prolonged the inevitable. I'm just saying that if people hadn't panicked, things might have turned out better. Of course! We panicked! We were scared! The plan was good. The execution was the messy part. That sounds an awful lot like you're saying it was their fault. What? No. No, that's not what I'm saying. Just... Ugh. I have to stop. I'm sorry. I don't want to slow us down. Can I just have a minute? Uh, yeah. Take a minute. Thank you. Alvin was supposed to be here for this. Is Alvin... He's dead is what he is. Thanks to that fucking madman back there. Kenny might know what to do. He had a family. Let's hope he made it to the meetup point then. What are you going to do with it? What do you mean by that? Uh, sorry. Just... Making conversation. It was nothing. No. What do you mean by that? Do with what? My baby? I'm just looking at the worst case scenario. You and Clem won't be able to raise a baby by yourselves. Not out here. I just mean it's going to need food. And, you know, other stuff. We can't just abandon it. Hey, whoa. I never said you should abandon it. I just mean that sometimes you can't protect everyone you'd want to. And you assume I won't be capable enough. Just because you're some angry loner who doesn't care about anyone but herself doesn't mean you know better than me. Hey, I've seen it before. Back when it started, me and my sister, we what? were- She died? I don't need your pity. You don't. You don't have the right. Jane. Shit, I didn't mean it. Jane, wait. Damn it. We can't just sit here doing nothing. I know, I know. They'll be here soon. Holy shit. It had been so long, we were starting to worry no one else would make it. Well, besides. How's Kenny? I tried to talk to Kenny, he flipped out on me. He started yelling. Scary shit. I know, he probably didn't mean it. But it was scary.
I've been nervous to even go near him. What? You think he's gonna shoot you? The way he is right now? I don't know. Maybe. He's not acting rationally. I've seen Kenny like this before. You think he'll, I don't know, snap out of it? I don't know. Clem, I was thinking now that you're here, maybe you could go talk to him? Okay. Sarita, God, wherever you are, please forgive me. I can't be alone again. Hi, Kenny. You think I don't know what y'all are whispering about over there? What's wrong with Kenny? Why is Kenny acting that way? Do you think Kenny's okay? It's all I hear from anyone anymore. We need your help to figure out a Grow plan. The fuck up and look around you, Clementine. Take a look at how our last plan worked out. There ain't some boat or some train or some other bullshit out of this one. Don't you think you've already done enough for today? I tried to save her. You think because you're a little girl, you can just get people killed and no one will care? That because you're sorry, it'll all magically go away? That's not how it works! Not for the last time. Just get the fuck out of here and leave me alone. I'm going crazy just sitting here not doing anything. Just give it time, Mike. It's still early. Clem, how'd it go? Kenny's really mad at me. Clem, you can't just expect him to bounce back. That man's going through. At least you try. Still, doesn't exactly help us figure out what we're gonna do now. We got no food, no water, it's getting damn cold, and we're losing daylight fast. When the others get back, they'll know what to do. Luke will have a plan. I thought Kenny would have a plan. Mike, Bonnie. <sighs> Mike's got a point. You can't just keep sitting around waiting. Things are difficult enough right now, and soon you'll have a baby on your hands too. We should go find Luke and Sarah. If they're in trouble, we might be able to help them. Clementine's right. After everything, after all this, if there's any chance they're still alive, we need to take it. I'll go. Clem can come with me. Thank you. Listen, Rebecca. If anything goes wrong here, you got something to protect yourself? I've got this. You don't think I'd need to... I don't know. But you better keep that close. Come on, Clem. 